All right, have and have not fans. Uh, wow. I mean, given the preview for next week, I've already done my episode review for Pray to Me and the trailer breakdown for Evil Offspring. I believe it's the title name. Uh, one of the biggest takeaways of last night's episode was the new character Gretchen, who I did find out will be in multiple episodes of season seven and eight. So she is not going anywhere anytime soon. Uh, in my episode review, I believe it was, I did mention, hey, in the comment section, what was the name of Gretchen's boyfriend? I couldn't understand when Gretchen said it. And I did watch a scene on multiple outlets with subtitles, but neither neither the um well excuse me none of the sources i used to watch the episode again were able to actually show me what the name was I, it was weird like even on my tv one uh when i watched the um excuse me when i watched it on my smart tv i went to own rewatch episode but the name didn't pop up i don't know why that was but at first i thought it was brian Byron, Byer, somebody told me it was barry it certainly didn't sound like barry so i'm just going to say buyer I know I could be completely wrong, but at the same time, guys, bear with me. I do not know. I think the title of this video is simply going to be, "What is Jeffrey? Is Jeffrey Owen? Con if is Jeffrey Owens connected to Gretchen? Now it's mentioned that Gretchen has a boyfriend, and her father. Well, we just assume her family overall is wealthy, and she's an heiress. So, could Jeffrey Owens either be the boyfriend, or could he be the father?" And what is, his, what is his connection with Charles? A lot of these questions we're going to find out next week. So honestly, we don't really need to go into it in depth because we don't really know that much. Plus, I've already talked about it in my trailer breakdown and the episode review. But either way, um, it's very interesting that, you know, Gretchen kind of has a similar complexion to Jeffrey Owens. So, and also I'm saying Jeffrey Owens because we do not know his character name yet. We All we know is that he's going to be playing a senator. That's it. That's all we know. Um... We don't know if he's Charles's vice president. Uh, could he be the senator of Michigan? That's why he's visiting Charles. I don't know. Not to mention this is all occurring over the same night, I believe. So this must be a, oh yeah, because of the shooting of, you know, the criers, you know, was national headline news at this point. Well, it was on the news. We know that much. Then perhaps, you know, after Oliver told Landon, that means a bunch of people in Charles's party know about what's going on. And they're like, wow, we dodged a bullet there. No pun intended, because even though Candace Young wasn't involved in the shooting, she was involved with the criers in Harrington. So it's a good thing you distance, distance it, distance yourself from her now. But I would be very interested to see if, um, you know, I think I'm more inclined to believe that Gretchen is. J Jeffrey Owens daughter, because I think that would be pretty awkward if, Jeffrey Owens character is the boyfriend to um, Gretchen and then she leaves him in bed to go see Charles and then Jeffrey Owens character goes to see Charles the same episode that doesn't just that doesn't seem right to me at all and plus in the preview for next week this is all I'm assuming still taking place within the same night so yeah I'm more inclined to believe that Jeffrey Owens if he is connected to Gretchen would be portraying her father instead of, you know, uh, the boyfriend. Not to mention, if Gretchen is an heiress, then there wouldn't be much of a need for her to be in a relationship with someone much older than her unless it was a power play or money, which obviously she doesn't need because she's an heiress. Yeah, I definitely think that Jeffrey Owens, if, she, he, if he is connected, would be the father. Yeah, that makes the most sense to me. And, uh... I guess that's about it. I mean, that, that's all. I mean, Charles and Gretchen were in a relationship. The argument could be made. Well, maybe Gretchen and Charles, after they broke up, she decided to rebound with another powerful political figure and then linked up with Jeffrey. Again, it's plausible on both sides, but I'm leaning more towards Jeffrey Owens' father. So uh, with that being said, I can't wait to see what happens next week. Uh, you know, if we get any clips released i will definitely do videos on them you know how i do on this channel especially the clips have substance you know they actually have enough meat for me to actually break down in a video to talk about but the preview for next week looks very very interesting it has me excited and it definitely has me pumped up more than any of the trailers we've gotten so far and with it being episode four i pray that it's a good episode
I mean, pray to me. Obviously, Wyatt, a.k.a. God, didn't hear my prayers on that one because it, it didn't please me at all. But uh, next week does look like it has multiple scenes that are worth watching. But with that being said, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. The relation, if any, between Gretchen and Jeffrey Owens' character. Uh, with Gretchen being around for a little while, what do you think her character is going to do? You know, if Candace and Charles don't link up together, will Gretchen be, I guess you could say, Charles' date to the inauguration? But then again, with how slow the show is moving... How far are we from the inauguration itself? I mean, the the election ended, what, not even a week ago in Have and Have Not's time, right? Right? I don't know. But in any case, thanks so much for tuning in. Let me know your thoughts. Make sure you subscribe to the channel if you are new. We are less than 197 views away from 20 million views on the channel. So make sure you share this video around for more views. Check me out on social media. Links are in the description below. And with that being said, I'll talk to you soon.